Hey everybody, welcome back. I am going to play a game that I don't think I've played on the channel before. I don't think I did Subnautica before, did I? I don't think so, because it's, it's too... It's too long. It would require so much recording and so much editing that I just think I was like, ah, I don't really want to deal with that. But now I'm going back because I want to see games that I have already played, but now I new computer and crank the graphics up a little bit. Uh, so I'm just gonna kind of go back through some stuff that I haven't done in a while, and I haven't done Subnautica in quite a while, but there's one thing I'm going to do different. I'm not ex I... <sighs> I've been trying to ever avoid doing this. Usually, I go for survival. Sometimes, if I'm feeling really frisky, I'll go for hardcore. But I'm gonna go creative. I don't have to worry about eating, don't have to worry about drinking, don't have to worry about oxygen, don't have to worry about health, at least I don't think. I have access to everything right off the bat. I just want to just frig around in the world for a while and see what happens. And if you guys haven't seen this game before, it's a whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, uh, yeah, I just kind of want to screw around in the world and have some fun and see what's in the places that I never spent enough time to get there. Your effective exploration range. Holy crap! Your I got floaters! Propulsion cannon? Stasis rifle? Food. I've already got my sea glide? Really? I don't have to build any of that? That's quick! <laughs> Alright, heck with it. Oh yeah, first time stepping out. This game is beautiful. If you haven't played it, I recommend it. It's a very fun survival game. Splash. Look at you. Look at you. You're a big old ugly. I don't even know if I have to worry about battery power. Oh, wow. This is going to be so cool. I can go anywhere. So let's see. I don't believe... Yeah, there's one of you. Come on! Come here! Come on! Come on, what you got? What you got? Come on, punk! Come here! Is he not even paying attention to me? He's not! This is insane. These guys are usually your first real big annoyance. But it doesn't seem to be letting me kill him either. He's, it's, it's, I don't know if you've noticed, but it's not going over so well. He's uh, he's kind of kind of just running away. But I mean, I guess I don't really need to kill him if I can get anything anytime I want. Nothing can die. Nothing. Oh, that's that's weird. I don't even need to, I don't even think I need to grab those things. I need to, I need to build, okay, wait, where did my, uh, where'd you go, where'd you go? This way! Okay, I'm gonna try building something down here. Uh, let's just, let's just build a basic ass base. Uh, so, really, really, is this how this is gonna go? Do I actually need things to build stuff? Like, is that a, is that a, Oops. Wrong button! Oh my god, everything's unlocked. So... I can build, like... Okay, no, wait, hang on. It's not gonna be here. We're not doing it here. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. What are you talking about? There's no such thing as oxy oxygenificity. Yep. Cause this is what I want to do. I want to go through all the stuff that I didn't get to see before. Like, I should be dead right now. I should be very, very dead. If you want to see how dead I should actually be, uh, I can, I can do another one that's, uh... I can do another one that, like, I actually have to, you know, have the equipment and that sort of thing. I wouldn't mind doing that. But also, just running around is cool. T compartment, X compartment, glass compartment, moon pool. I can build a moon pool already. Oh, really? Really? 
Really? Okay. Uh, where's my entrance hatch? There we go. I'll slap a hatch on this bad boy. I think I'm going to make it so that the hatch is on this side. Boom. There we go. High speed, too. Real high speed. Um, uh, alright. So we're gonna build a corridor. Uh, out from there. It's gonna be... That's, uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, nope, there. Stop it! You're being difficult. There we go. And we're gonna build a T-corridor right here, because I w or the next compartment, rather. Because I want to be able to add more things. So, like, uh, that way I can go... Uh, right here is going to be my moon pool. Uh, wait, how do I... Oh boy, I don't remember how to rotate it. I want it to be... Ah, uh, crap. How do I rotate? One second. Ah, hell, I don't know if I can rotate or not. Whatever. Build it! So now I've got a moon pool, which is pretty cool. Especially since I, like, just started. Oh, man, look at it. Look at this, look at it! It's so beautiful. I've got my own base already. It's got a moon pool. I can build things here. Oh, this is so cool. All right, I'm gonna keep going. Well, this doesn't seem dangerous at all. Just swim right down next to this volcanic thingamajig. And we'll put our thermal plant right down here somewhere. Somewhere right about. Who cares about the aurora? I'm way over here. I'm trying to put down a thermal plant, yo. It's only 97 degrees here. Jeez. <laughs> Celsius. Oh, so it's almost boiling. That's perfect. Uh, so what do I... How, wait, how do I use that to get power up to my base? Do I have, like, wires that I can run or something? Oh, I have to build a network of these things. Okie dokie. Neat. That'll be fun. Does my base even need power, or am I just an idiot? Did I just waste a whole pile of time? Because I definitely just spent a whole bunch of time trying to make sure there's power to my base, and I think there's already plenty of power. Crap. Oh, mobile vehicle bay. That's what I needed. Uh, so I actually have to go back out. Ah, oh, nuts. I'm gonna have to remember to come straight back down, because I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna build myself a vehicle! And I'm almost there. Spoosh! Okay, uh, so, let, let, let that go! Let that go! Three. Um... Right. In my inventory, I have a... ba 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 da Mobile vehicle bay. Sure, that'll go number one. Whatever. Can I place you somewhere, please? There we go. It went further away than I thought it would. There we go. So now I can construct vehicles? Oh, yes. Oh, I can build a Neptune escape rocket already. So I can beat the game, like, instantly. Sea moth, cyclops, prawn suit. I'll show you guys all the, all the different stuff, because we'll make it, we'll make it a fairly quick episode. I don't want it to take forever, but I love my sea moth. Oh yeah, this thing is the best thing for exploring. However, when it starts, you can see it's only supposed to go down to 200 meters. But, we don't have to worry about that. So, let's hop back out of it. And we'll make another vehicle, because I actually haven't seen the rocket. I haven't seen the rocket. We will eventually do it, but I will... I want to build the other stuff first. The prawn suit, I also never got to. 
operating a prawn suit to feel a sense of limitless power. Prawn operators receive weeks of training to counteract this phenomenon. You will have to make do with <laughs> Come back, prawn suit! Welcome Yay. aboard, Captain. Oh, it has limited, like, hover. Well, this is weird. Well, this is kind of cool. What do these do? I can, I can grip and grab with my hands. Cha 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 cha. Okay. Uh, that's neat as all hell. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. And it can go down to 900 meters. That's crazy. All right, and now for the big one. Let's build our Cyclops. Be and I have built this before. Designed to be operated by a three-person crew. Only experienced Helms people should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. Look at that thing load in. She's massive. That is so cool. And the water may not be deep enough here. I have no idea. <laughs> And we gotta go for a hatch. There she is. They actually had to put a, a floating thing that tells you where it is that you enter and it's that big. Look how big this sucker is! Look at all this! Look at all this room! So much room! Oh yeah. It's good to be back in this thing. And man, do you ever climb ladders fast in this? You can also, Oh, you can also do stuff too. You can be like, boop. And then you can like change the color of it and yeah it's pretty cool it's a pretty cool submarine and it drives exactly the way you would expect it to stupid freaking slow power up the engine oh yeah let's go i want to run right into you Douche. Wow, doesn't feel quite as good in creative mode. <sighs> it's slow as hell. It is super duper slow. But, I mean, it can go... Uh, you can get uh, depth upgrade modules for it and everything, and it's essentially like a giant base that you drive around in. Neptune escape rocket, let's do it, let's beat the game! Neptune, oh, I gotta build a launch platform first. Oh, yeah, that's gonna, holy crap, that's gonna be big. Hoo-wee! I'm not even letting it get to the point where that ship explodes. By the way, that ship that's in the background there, that one right over there, that explodes after like the first day. I haven't even made it to the first night yet. Holy crap, it's humongous! I guess I have to actually go to the launch platform to be able to build it. Oh yeah, it's, oh my God, it's big. Oh, I wasn't expecting it to be this big. I don't know why not, it's a rocket. We'll just, we'll construct that. Oh my. Guys, this is something that you shouldn't get to until the very end of the game. There's no reason you should have this this early in the game. This is literally like the last thing you do. I didn't even take a look at what it takes to build the rocket. Oh, I forgot to look at it, but I'm sure it was stuff that 
I probably haven't even... I've never even seen. Okay, so you got that, uh, that big old, uh, that big old platform there, yeah? Yeah? I see it. I see it. Oh, you have to do this in multiple stages. Plasteel ingots, nickel ore, aerogel, and a wiring kit for the boosters. I love that it plays this, like, epic music every time. It's like, oh yeah, you're building a rocket ship! It knows I love building rocket ships! Oh. Maybe I will take my sea moth and do some explo- Ho 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 ho, Ren. That is crazy. That is nuts. Um, yeah, maybe I'll go do some exploring. Uh, and see if I can't show you guys a few of the sights. Because I don't know how long this video is going to be, but maybe I'll just do... I really just kind of want to do one. I mean, if you guys want me to actually play the game and try to make it all the way through it, I'd be willing to do that, but it take it it'd take a while. Oh my god. But they're just now warning me that that ship might explode. I'm already building a rocket. This is nuts. I will finish building this thing, but before I board it, uh, doesn't give me any options to what colors I want on it. That's not fair. <laughs> but before I do that, I'll, I'll show you guys around. We'll find, we'll look at some of the cool places. Some places I probably haven't even been. Cyclops shield generator, plastic ling, and enamel glass computer chip. It's really, it's not requiring anything that I haven't seen so far. I don't think. Wow. That's kind of big. Hey, look, we're getting into night. I think night is when the aurora actually explodes. I can't quite remember, but I'm pretty sure it's the first night. Oh, wow. Neptune One Rocket Online. What? I can change the colors! <laughs> yes! Let's make our rocket orange. And the stripe on it. Oh, that's stripey. That's going to be a, a blue stripe on the orange rocket. Stripe number two is going to be uh, a black stripe. And the name is going to be in glorious white, I guess. Oh. And rocket name. The rocket's name shall be... What? Stababbage. Stababbage. That is the name of my rocket. Look at that. It's beautiful. I can't actually see it. It's too nighttime. Way too nighttime. There's the aurora. Okay, so in this biome, I know I've run across a leviathan before. He's in here somewhere. He's very close to the ship. Oh, wait, but that's after the ship has already explodurated. Huh, I don't know if he'll be here right now. Well, we'll find out. There. Hello there, big boy. I knew you were around here. <laughs> what you doing, buddy? I would never get even close to this close to him in the real game. Screw that. Dude's terrifying. He eat you up in one gulp. He'd just go hop and you'd be done. I'm trying to run in and see if he'll attack me. I want him to do is because he'll grab you and he'll push you, I believe. Like, he'll grab a hold of your ship and just like, Aah! like, swim with it. Are you gonna do it? 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 Yeah, there it is! Let me go. Oh, he just, like, never lets go, does he? Oh, no, there he goes. 
All right. Yeah, you can imagine how that would be if I wasn't currently invincible. Might be a little bit scarifying. <laughs> but I want to try and make it back to my floatsy base so that we can watch the aurora explode. It's going to happen the first thing in the morning, isn't it? Or is it the second night? I don't even know. Stub Abbage! This does kind of take all the joy out of it. Oh, come on! Let me go! Oh, it's terrible looking. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. I didn't expect it to be good, but that was really bad. Let's see if we can get a little closer to red there. That just looked like a big old banana. That's a little bit better. We'll go with that. That's my rocket! That's my new rocket! Well, my old rocket. Stababbage! Okay, now we just have to sit around and wait for that sucker to explode. That should only take a whole lot of time. What the heck? A quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. Oh, it's going now. Reach a supercritical state. 18 minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 3, 2, 2 1. There's the big explosion! I thought it was supposed to happen before night! Wow! Yeah. Cause now I'm chock full of radio. So yeah, the whole deal is that I'm infected with what something from this planet. I'm not going to give away spoilers as to what happens, because I do know a lot of what happens, and that wouldn't be fair, because we're just doing a quick look at this thing, and I'm trying to figure out how exactly am I supposed to get in this jeeping fripple banana fana fo fana rocket. It's huge! Is this an elevator? Can this be an elevator? Is this can be an elevator? Oh, oh, it is. It's... it's... It's my elevator. It's my elevator. I wonder if anybody's ever been like, Yes! I'm going to win the game! And then fell off of this and died. <laughs> um... Okay. Let's get in the big ol' rocket. Oh, there's stuff inside. Um... Hydraulic systems? Oh, you gotta power this sucker up. Pressurizing hydraulics. Auxiliary power unit? Oh, neat. Auxiliary power unit. Communications Online. array? I built all of this with my bare hands! Communications systems array active. And here's the thing. I don't think I should be showing any of what happens here. I don't even think I should be watching what happens here. Primary CPU. Online. Primary computer systems active. Oh, man. Prepare time capsule. Oh, I can put things in it? Um, here, you can, you can have these fins, I guess, and, uh, you, you can, you can have a cyclop depth module, and you can have my, um, I don't know, you want, you want to, you're going to have to, you're going to already have a habitat builder, what about a thermal blade, there you go. Yeah, that's for you. Good job, you. Status one of three. Image. I didn't take any pictures. 
Hang on, I gotta get the time capsule ready. F11. There, I got a screenshot of literally me getting ready to leave. Booyah. And select that one. And the message is gonna say, I cheated. Good job. I cheated. You can too. All right, now the time capsule is ready. Time capsule. Yes. Ready. What about my support system? Life support systems online. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So does that mean the rocket's All ready? Systems are go. I really shouldn't be doing this. I don't deserve to see the end, but I'm doing it anyway. If you don't want to be spoiled, turn the video off now. Cannot launch rocket while quarantine. <gasps> Enforcement platform is really. Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! They actually blocked me. Well then. None of us get to see it because uh, I'm still infected and the quarantine, uh, the quarantine thingamajig is still active. I don't think that's a good idea to dive like that, but hey, there you have it. Alright, well if I'm not allowed to do it without uh, doing a bunch of other key component stuff, um, then I guess we're not doing it this time. It would probably take me a few hours to actually beat this, even though I'm in creative mode, but... I mean, if you guys want to see me actually go through it and do the things and... visit all the stuff, we can do it in creative mode and I'd just take my time and you could just join with me and we'd go find things. Um, but that's entirely up to you guys. You guys let me know if you want me to do something like that, so... As it stands right now, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as always, guys, take care. Game on.